Oh. Took this lock. Could have just went up here, to be fair, but... There we go. I nearly missed that. Was the Grand Master an assassin? Well, the original. Uh, the Grand Master mainly works for... Uh, yeah. The way it works out is, you're taken in by a, a guy who is actually a Templar. A leading member of the Templar, but he did strike a deal with the Assassins uh, for a truce. And this truce was lasting perfectly well, and everything was going fine, until the Templars decided uh, to basically kill him. And when they did that, uh, they wanted someone else in power who was going to fight against Assassins rather than make a deal with them. Which was the bottom line, so... They killed him in cold blood. It was basically a mutiny, if you know what that is. It's like they do on ships. <laughs> they the pirates. A mutant. When a pirate is not... When a captain is not fulfilling his duty, his crew will perform a mutiny to put someone else in charge who will do the job. That's basically what the Grand... The Grand Master was... He was being nice. The original Grand Master, uh, Delisaire, was being nice and he decided, you know, we're gonna... We're gonna all be friends and strike a little, strike a little deal. But the new grandmaster didn't like that shit. He said, "Hell no. We kill assassins, and assassins try to kill us. So you're getting killed for helping them." And his daughter Elise, who's a very close friend of Arno here, a very, very, very close friend of Arno. <laughs> is also a Templar herself. So you can see how everything comes into play. Hope that helped some form of explanation. <laughs> ah you're just in time for the commencement of my reign. Your reign. As long as there's a cour des miracles, we must have a roi des tunes. And since there seemed to be a vacancy, I stepped in. With remarkable speed, the body's not yet cold. I may have set things in motion a trifle early. Say, when you first arrived at La Cour des Miracles, you used me. Your target is dead. We used one another. Quite a kingdom you've inherited. It is, isn't it? So, is justice served? Are the dead avenged? Is your soul soothed, all that rot? Rot is a fine description. Every time I think I'm getting close to the truth, it seems another layer of filth presents itself. <gasps> Conspiracy, intrigue, the rapidly thickening plot. Add some bestiality and a lecherous priest, and I say you have the beginnings of a beautiful novel. I'd settle for a solid lead. So young, and yet so serious. Well, best of luck to you. You have, I trust, looked into this. Where did you get that? One of my newly loyal subjects brought it to me as a token of esteem, as it were. It's a curious piece. I know of only one silversmith who works metal like this. A blade of this make killed Monsieur de la Serre. I can only assume you knew this already. Why didn't you say? Well, where would man be if he never had to ask questions? If everything he could ever want to know was simply handed to him, he might no longer think to ask questions. Or he might accomplish a great deal more unburdened by ignorance. Perhaps. The smith's name is François Thomas Germain. You'll find his shop near Réal. Thank you. Bonne chance. Okay. 
Is he after the man that killed his father? He just actually... We just killed the two men who jointly killed his father. But they were commanded to by a... Uh, someone higher up in the... Well, the man who wants to obviously take over the Templar Order. So... We just killed... Uh, Radatun And... Uh, what was the other guy's name? Uh, God, I'm so bad with names, especially when they're French. But yeah, those two guys were just killed, but now we need to work our way up the ladder to find the guy who ordered them to take his uh, uh, his father and his... Oh, sorry, not his, they didn't kill his father. They killed the guy who took him in as a surrogate father. The guy who killed his father does present himself, though. Now he's after the boss, giving the orders. Yeah, but we have to work our way up the up the ladder to find the boss. Might take a little bit of time, but <laughs> uh, so yeah. What is next for us? We're going back to the cafe, by the looks of it. Uh, back to the assassins bureau. Oh, but of course, we're going to stop off at the cafe first. But we killed the we killed the guy who killed we killed the guys who killed the guy. Who uh, had the peace with it? So with the uh, assassins of the Templars, his father, or Arno's father, who was an assassin. I think he was an assassin. Pretty sure. But he was working with them, so he was sort of working with everybody. I don't know. Whatever. <laughs> we find it later on. Uh, yeah, we've had a few people talking. A few people have popped up saying, saying hi and. Uh, Asking a few things, you know. We've got a new command as well, since you've left. Uh, resets. Shows how many times we have to, if we're going through a level or a mission, and we don't get 100% sync, we have to restart that mission from the very start. And that right there shows how many resets we've done so far. At the minute, I'm happy enough we've only done one, and that was that last mission we just did, because uh, I forgot to get Phantom Blitz. Which, entirely my fault. <laughs> but I'm just going to blame you guys for not reminding me. Yeah, I get that, man. Yeah, it picks up as you go along. I'm not in any rush to go anywhere or do anything. I've got time to kill. And it's good killing it with people in stream. Oh, no. What chi- 